The Economic and Financial Crimes Commission (EFCC), along with residents of Benin City, the Edo State Capital, have embarked on an anti-corruption walk. As a way of ridding the country of corruption, the anti graft agency led by the Benin Tunnel head, Mukta Ibrahim, took the work across major streets, beginning from the Commission's zonal office. Tagged Anjun Youth's March Against Corruption, the move is aimed at mobilizing youths against corruption. Speaking to journalists, EFCC Benin Zonal Head Mukta Bello said the future of Nigeria lies with the youth due to its large population. 90% of the population is being dominated by the youth, which are the future leaders of tomorrow. So it is also a of fact that for us to succeed in fighting the corruption and build up Nigeria, it is need of and that is why the hard work is being achieved, work for you understand. Now, it is very important for us to make their peace. The main target is to bring them together, expose them, and oblige them to fight for us for this, and also use them to fight for us for the future because they are the future leaders of this. On his part, Edo State Coordinator of the National Youth Service Corps, NYC, Adebayo Ojo, said government is doing all it can to curb restiveness in the country. Go to NYC camp. Usually in the past, we know that uh, some members will get into the NYC camp and just uh, get inducted uh, uh, into doing what uh, he's supposed to do during the service. But now, the key acquisition team is part of the team, and all the state government, including the federal government, if the federal government is making the possible by the way, giving out the loan. I've learned that in the EFC we're going to use today as the one the 14th of February, the one they call Valentine's Day, to celebrate a, a work against corruption. Because we knew it was a good effort that we joined. That we can also send a message that corruption is bad, but we keep totally.